Hello YouTube, JT Sanders here and welcome back to Undertale. So yeah, so after that um, almost, almost disastrous boss fight by Met my Metaton XE, or EX, wait, my bad, EX. So um, now I've uh, escaped into the city, or some, it looks like a city, I'm not really sure if it's actually background or not, but I'm going to say it's a city. Um... Yeah, it's city. <laughs> Anyways, so I just got back from playing with my friend. Remember Six Siege, good game, good game. Nine of Logitech, 2016. And uh, hopefully I'll be able to go on my way and hopefully won't kind of any more enemies or boss fights for the um, remainder of the Penguin Bobber. <laughs> ah, sorry, excuse me. What's in here? Cool, new home. Whoa, what's this place? Nice music. Oh my god, wait a minute. Is this where I first. Is this Terrio's house? Place is blocked by two padlocks, no attached. Howdy! I'm in the garden. If you have anything you need to get off your chest, please don't hesitate to come. The keys are in the kitchen hallway. Oh yeah, in the hallway. Oh my god, this reminds me of Terrio's room, house, whatever it is. Oh my god. I like the music though. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Uh, a long time ago, a human fell into the ruins. Injured by its fall, the human called out for help. Uh -oh. You took the key and put it in the kitchen. Cool. Oh my god. I like the song. Jesus. Wow, this is amazing. It's a bureau. There's a Santa Claus outfit inside. I'm gonna take that. It's a king size bed. It's Asgore's journal. All the current pages says it's a nice day today. The ink is still almost wet. Hmm, he was just there. He or she. Oh my god. I really like this atmosphere though. It's like really, really amazing. Heart shaped lock inside a box. Will you take it? I mean, it's not mine, so I'm not gonna take it. I mean, it's a worn dagger inside a box. Will you take it? No. What does it say? How does it look like it? Yeah, I might as well take it. No, I'm not gonna take the gap dagger though. Because I'm a man. Men don't need to defend themselves. I don't think there's anything here. I can probably check it. Out. If something tells me there's a bit of irony into it, I mean, why? Israel, the king's son, heard a human's call. He brought the human back to the castle. Now, something tells me all this happiness is like is really just a mask to what's going on. Like, it's like what's really happening on the inside. I mean, I'm just saying. Over time, Ezreal and a human became like siblings. The king and queen treated the human and child as their own. The underground was full of hope. Yeah, sometimes we just a lot of irony going on, or you know, false claims and whatnot, saying that everybody's all happy and all that, and oh, this is just a trap. I'm waiting, bro. I'm bracing. I'm, I'm, I'm embracing myself. This reminds me of Toyo's house, though. Oh my God. That's cool. That's alright. Oh, duh. The key. We like the chain. Cool. This has got to be Toro's house, man. This has got to be Toro's house. What is this? And then, one day, the human became very ill. Ooh. You know about someone's stories? Oh. The sick human have only one request. To see the flowers from their village. But there was nothing we could do. The next day, the next day, the human died. Oh, oh my God! Israel wrecked with grief, absorbed the human soul. He transformed into a being with incredible power. Okay, so Israel had a path. With the human soul, Israel crossed through the barrier. He carried the human's body into the sunset, back to the village of the humans. Okay. All right. Very cinematic. Israel reached the center of the village. There, he found a bed of golden flowers. He carried the human onto it. All right. 
guy seems um, kind of hospitality, you know. Suddenly, screams rang out. The villagers saw Ezra holding a human body. They thought he had killed them, child. The humans attacked him with everything they got or had. He was struck with a blow after blow. Israel had the power to destroy them all. Oh man, oh shoot, that ain't good. That's not good. But Israel did not fight back. Clutching the human, Israel smiled and walked away. Wounded, Israel stumbled home. He entered the castle and collapsed. His dust spread across the garden. The king fell into despair. Despair. The king and queen had lost two children in one night. The humans had once again taken everything from us. Oh shoot, that's why. That's what happened. The king decided it was time to end our suffering. Everything. Fall, every human who falls down must die with enough souls who can shatter the barrier forever. It's not long now. King Asgore will give us Okay, a little bit of a tragedy going on. You should be smiling, too. Aren't you excited? Why? Aren't you happy? Well, I'm not sure about that. I mean... A, bit, a, little, a little bit of um, mis misconception and misinformation going on. You're going to be free. Oh, shoot, don't tell me. Oh my god. Well, the music and I hope and the sadness going on, you know. What's out here? Ooh, oh, shoot. Okay, it's all dark and lesson, You know, my shadow's going on in the background. I don't like it. What's this? Whoa. Oh, shoot. Who are you? Um, this is the final showdown. <laughs> okay, church bells are ringing. Something's gonna happen. Something's gonna happen. Something's definitely gonna happen. So you finally made it. The end of the journey is at hand. In a few moments, you will meet the king. Together, you will determine the future of this world. That's then. Now, you will be judged. You'll be judged for every, every action. You'll be judged for every EXP you've earned. What's EXP? It's, it's an acronym. It stands for execution points. Oh, shoot. A way of quantifying the pain you have inflicted on others. When you kill someone, the EXP increases. When you have any EXP, love increases. Love, too, is an acronym. It stands for a level of violence. Oh, shoot. A way of measuring someone's capacity to hurt. What a flower lied to me. <laughs> the more you kill, the easier it'll be. The easier it becomes to distance yourself. The more you distance yourself, the less you are hurt. The more easy you will bring yourself to hurt others. Oh, Sans. Oh, hi. But you never gain any love. Okay. That doesn't mean you're completely innocent or naive. Just that you kept your you kept your certain tenderness in your heart. No matter the struggles or hardships you faced, you strive to do the right thing. You refuse to hurt anyone. Even when you ran away, you still you did it with a smile. You never gained you never gained love, but you gained love. Oh, yeah. Does that make sense? I get it. I get it. Maybe not. Now. About to face, but a little about to face the greatest challenges of your journey. The action's here. We determine the fate of the entire world. If you refuse to fight, Asgore will take your soul and destroy humanity. But if you kill Asgore or go home, monsters are trapped. Uh, little, 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 ah, words remain trapped on the ground. What you would do? Oh shoot. Well, if you were, if, well, if I were you, I would throw him in a towel by now. But you didn't get this far by giving up, did you? No, oh, that's right. You did something called determination. So as long as you hold on, so as long as you as you do what's in your heart, I believe you can do the right thing. All right, we're all Kanye, you kid. Good luck. All right, cool. Nice, you know, music going on. Nice, nice, nice symbolism. First off, I like I like the way it's set up. You know, a little bit of um, can be an acronym of not acronym, but it can be like symbolism of um, no distance and whatnot. So I'm at a final stretch here. Cool. Fun. All right. All right, let's do this. I'm ready, bro. I'm ready. Let's end this right here, right now. What's down here for stuff? I don't want to go in that room yet. Oh. Whoa. 
It's a coffin. There's a name engraved on it. Jeremy. It's empty. Oh, shoot. Are all those coffins mine, too? I mean, I didn't kill anyone, so I'm assuming it's all mine. Good God. Wow, y'all saved the coffin for me. Holy shoot. So basically, I have a choice here. If I um don't kill Asgard, then I'll risk um, trapping all the monsters in here. But if I, if I will spare him, then I will risk killing myself. Hence why the coffin's on the ground. Okay, all right. What is Asgard's just mm -hmm. doom de dum Oh, so someone here. Yeah, just a moment. I have almost finished watering the flowers. He seems nice. He seems really nice for a big beast like him. Here we are. Oh, shoot. Whoa. Howdy. How can I... You look at my tutorial. Oh, my God. Oh. Are, are you going to be like a father figure, too? Oh, Jesus. I so badly want to say with, like, a cup of tea. But you know how it is. Oh, my God. You're really... You're really like Torio. Oh, my God. Are you two married? Are you two siblings? <laughs> Holy crap. Birds are singing, flowers are blooming, perfect weather to catch we get for a game to catch. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm I'm play catch with you. I don't, wanna, I don't wanna fight you, bro. You seem menacing enough. Bad enough, bad enough if I face Toriel, bro. You know what we must do. We're not ready. I'm coming to you next show. Yeah, I'm gonna be prepared. Uh, resisting myself. Uh, check to see if uh, the camera's ready. Alright, okay. Alright, I'm, I'm ready, bro. Final showdown, and it is. I'm almost done. Wow. Come to think, I'm almost done. Holy cow. It's a throne. So, he's basically the one that's holding it all together. He's basically. He, so, he's basically like, you know, the one who's in charge of the whole kingdom underground. You know, I really wanna. I really wanna get. Uh, what's McCullough? Fucking. Freaking. Um, I forgot his name. How tense. Just think of it like a visit to the dentist. Yeah, so you're gonna drill holes in my teeth and knock me out and hopefully hope for the best, you know? You know, probably do much worse than dentists, you know? I'm not scared of you though. I've, I've, I've adapted, bro. Hope you hope if you're not, I understand. I'm not ready either. Oh God, this guy, even this guy knows. This guy knows he's gonna square up. Let me save it here. What about to say? Forget Undyne, Undyne, that's your name. I'm, I'm afraid Undyne will come out and just play, play a dirty behind trick on me. Ooh. Am I going to Twilight Zone? Ooh, this is the barrier. Oh shoot! This is what keeps us all. A little. This is what keeps us all trapped on the ground. If, if by any chance, you have you have any unfinished business, please do what you must. That's terrifying. That's like, um, purgatory. Like that. That's legit purgatory right there. That's that's terrifying. I'm gonna go back. I see. Anything you must do is important enough. Even something as small as reading a book or taking a walk, please take a time. Ooh, you're really nice. Now I want to check the elevator first. I want to, I want to go to the remaining rooms to see what's there to offer for me. If not, then I'm gonna face my face my fears and trying to, um, you know, invade and do what I do best for my, um, you know. I, I'm I'm nervous. I'm I'm really am nervous. That's why I'm just trying to. Think of words, and I'm like, that's why I'm stumbling with words first off. I'm, I'm trying to think here. Like, I don't want to face this guy off. He's menacing enough. All right, what's over this? What's over here? Oh, is this an elevator? Wow, that's nothing. Never mind. Okay, never mind. I'm gonna go back. My fault. I'm sorry. All right, let's 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 do this, man. Now I've heard that um, my friend told me that if you go into genocide mode, Sands will. Be the second last, but it would be like the last second boss, second last boss, or whatnot. And uh, he's pretty difficult. I've heard. I I've, I've seen. He's he's terrifying. He's he's terrifying in terms of difficult situations. Like that dude will wreck. The dude will rock your shit. <laughs> he will rock you. All right. And I'm I'm I might do another playthrough, in case you guys don't know. I'm gonna do another playthrough and didn't say more. Probably do another one after that in between. That's terrifying. Back so soon? How are you feeling? I'm, I'm feeling. I'm feeling amazed. I'm feeling ready to do this. Let's go. That hurt. That hurt. That is it then. I'm. I'm not liking that. Like, like, that's that's legit terrifying. That's creepy. Ready? Yes, I'm ready. Let's go. Let's do this. Those coffins are for me. Those hearts. Those um, love are for me. A strange light fills the room. 
Oh god, twilight is shining through the barrier. Yes, I know, the twilight zone, like I said. It seemed a journey is finally over. Oh, this is the final boss. You're filled with determination. Yes, yes, let's go. Nice last words to the ending journey. It was nice to meet you. Goodbye. Oh, sh oh okay. Like I said, terrifying. <laughs> oh, you took away despair. Okay, now, not now, okay, now is now or never. Okay, you look menacing, like I said. Okay, I can't spare you, I can't do nothing. I don't have any food in me. Okay, I'm, 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 I'm screwed, I'm screwed. Can I talk to you, please? I'd like to ask you, I don't want to fight him. His hands tremble for a moment. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, okay, alright, okay, okay, cool, cool, okay. You like Toriel? See, just keep talking. He's breathing and gets funny for a moment. Alright, cool. Okay, what am I gonna do? Oh, okay, I know what to do. <laughs> I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Attack comes in with the drop. Okay, it seems reasonable enough. Fuck! Alright, okay. Hmm. I know what to do. I know what to do. I'm, I'm kind of terrified. I'm. Hmm, this guy. This guy wants to go all Chris Angel on me. The guy wants to go all Tricky Wickies on me. Okay, I see how I want to go. I see. I see. Alright. Let me try it one more time. Okay, now I understand this is gonna be final boss. This is gonna be difficult as hell. Ugh. So all those hearts are his, or or all those mine? No, no mercy. I, I see. No mercy. I know what we're going for here. Oh lord. Okay, you tremble. Oh, not sadly. Ah. Okay, there's a padding. There's a padding. Ah! Oh! Never mind. We collected him in flashes in his eyes. Some chance to trouble. Fuck! Okay, okay, oh! Oh! Okay, that hurt. Alright, that's fine. That's cool. You know what? I'm fine. I'm determined. I'm determined to not kill this guy. <laughs> Whatever, you like, you remind me of, you remind, you remind me really fond of Toyo, of course, but I'm guessing there's a little bit of symbolism saying how, um, this person will let me leave. It's, it's like, it's like, you know, I'm trying to think of a word here, like, like, not, 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 not like a momentum, but like, it's, um, fuck, what is it called? It's like, it's like, they, no, 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 don't fight, don't fight, don't fight, don't fight. It's like a, um, collection like right? so they have like one of those flashback scenarios where ah where it's like happening a little bit again I can't I can't think of the word right now I really can't think of the word right now oh are you serious we to get more health at then wait Oh, back at it again, I see. Alright, okay. I'm a, I'll be right back. I'll be right back. I'm gonna find more health. Mm. Yeah. Alrighty, um... I can't really do anything other than check and talk. Ah, shoot! <sighs> At this point, really undecisive at the moment. Ugh. 45 minutes! I've been for 45 minutes, alright. I didn't know it was that fast. Ugh, that long, that quick. Alright, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna come at this, bro. I'm keeping at this. Ah! Thank <laughs> you. 
up. Got it. Mm. Mm. Well, I'll remind you that. Mm. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, yeah, I'm gonna have to end it here, unfortunately, again. Yeah, I'm I'm really sorry. I have to end it here. I've been I've been at this for like an hour or two, basically an hour. But uh, I'm gonna figure this out. Fortunately, like that's basically two games I have to end it and end it right then and there because I don't know what to do. Ugh, sucks. But um, yeah. Again, thanks so much for watching. I'm gonna continue this. I'm gonna continue this on Thursday probably, and I'm gonna figure out a way to beat them and whatnot. But um, this guy's gonna be this is gonna be a long one. <laughs> I'm not even gonna lie. This this is gonna be a legit long one. Like it's gonna be a toughie. So um, in the meantime, hope you like this video. I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.